Hello, this tutorial is about creating RESTful controller in Laravel to do crude operation in the database. First of all, I will create the controller, this controller, by using this command. And create a model named to the list for the table to the list and the table contains two records now so run the command <coughs> run this command to create the model your okay, model file is already created now go for step 3 open the controller Okay, you can see when you create a RESTful or resource controller, then these default methods are created automatically. Now, uh, add this line from the model. Save the file and add the routing line for the this controller here uh, you can see the difference between the normal controller and resource controller is the routing path here you have to use resource and when you will tap list then it will automatically call the index method of list controller which is empty now save the file and go here and add this line to the index method of list controller Here, yeah, this line will retrieve all records of the to do list table and for each loop will iterate the records and print the value of the name field. So now I will test this code by typing the URL value. Uh, before that, I have to start the server. Okay, now that local host thousand slash list and this is the value of the name field. Now go for step five and add this code to the show map. Show method is empty now, and uh, here there is an ID dollar ID parameter which will re uh, catch the value from the URL and search the record in the table based on this ID. If the record exists, then it will print the name and description uh, field value in the browser. Suppose uh, my searching ID is 9. So save the file first and now test the code and type here slash 9. Here you can see new to uh, do the list pre vacation planning, which is the value of this row. And if I type 10 here, Lambda, this value will display. Okay, 
Now go for the step 8 to insert a new record in the Toodleist table. And this data will be added, sorry, this code will be added in the create method. Here you can see to do list create array and here these three fields are mandatory fields of my to do list table so I have to give the value of these fields and if it can execute properly then data is successfully inserted this message will be print save the file and now to call the create method you have to type here list create okay when this error exists when you are trying to insert data then you have to add some code in your to-do list or php model file that is the filiable name description email and uh, this will not exist in our table and rules validation rules to make the insertion successful so this code will need to uh, insert the data in the table now if i again execute the uh, URL then this message will appear database is successfully inserted now refresh you can see the new data is executed uh, here I have run this code for two times that's why this uh, duplicate records arrive okay go for the step 10 to see how update works in the uh, resource controller so add this code in the edit method of list controller and this is the edit method okay Here is also a parameter dollar ID which will be uh, get from the URL and uh, search that record based on this ID and if the record exists then uh, it will update the data like this new name suppose name field will be new name and there is another field description which will be modified description to new description okay now save the file and tag the ID value and edit text here suppose I will change the record of 12 ID so type 12 slash edit okay. data is updated successfully now refresh the browser now you can see new name and new description in this way you can update any record based on the record ID or primary key go for the step 12 to see the delete operation uh, just copy the code sorry copy the code and paste it in the destroy method which also contain ID parameter but it not work like edit method and I have to assign the route for delete record from the database so in the web.php file 
add this routing path to call the destroy method that's when list particular id and delete when you will add this in the url then it will call destroy with id value save the file and suppose i will remove the 12 record then type here delete now refresh the table and you can see the 12 is removed in this way you can add delete edit and create record in the in any database table thank you for watching